Hey everybody, welcome back to Spyro the Dragon on the Reunited Trilogy. So, uh, I think it's probably about time that we uh, finish this up. So as right now we got uh, Twilight Harbor, uh, we got uh, the Nasty Nork fight, and then the, uh, the final bonus secret uh, area. Well, that's a great. Take that. Huh, so they did actually kind of. Uh, I guess you could say sensor. The, uh, when it comes, when it comes to the guns, because those guys, I think, had actual. Had, like, had, had, like, actual, uh. Uh. Gatlin guns. I think. Okay, that that I think yeah, that was one of the gears that I need to uh get rid of for a trophy. Yeah, so like if I take a look at that at one of the, at these guys, yeah, because they, they they got like I don't know, they looked like Splatoon cannons. <laughs> Oh my god, wow, they have... That guy has amazing tracking. Yeah, that's weird. Huh. <laughs> oh man. So that was okay. That was the second one. Okay, so this is the yeah. So that means this is the second. One. This is the second building. Oh, oh no. What? Be on the lookout for North Commando, Spyro. They better be on the lookout for me. Um, that was interesting. Huh. <laughs> All right then. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna leave that as uh, as is. So for this, I have to use the ramp, do a supercharged ramp jump across the second floor of the building, jump across the next platform. There's three yellow gems. 
Uh, there's an entrance to the other building, and the gear's on the right side. Okay. So I made it up here. Nothing's over there. Nothing's... Nothing's over there. I'm gonna have to do another another jump over to Gibbert to get that. But so wait, so where am I supposed to go from here? Uh, jump across the next platform. Three yellow gems are. Go to the entrance frame of the other building and you'll spot the gear on the right side. Oh, okay. Wow, that's... That's actually an interesting spot. I mean, where's that rat? Get your rat. Okay, so that's three out of six of these gears. Go back the way you came. Continue to set the next buildings until you reach the room with the flooded pink light. The fourth gear is found near the entrance of the pink room. Well, I'm going to assume it's the one right on my left there, but I have to get... I forgot, actually, I think it's easier, yeah, it's easier just to go back down, because it's a straight, yeah, it's a straight pathway. Mm. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, so it's easier just to actually use it without, do this without using the, uh, the lift. In fact, I want to see that again. I want to see how... I like zipped across the screen. Oh, now it won't happen again. That was so weird. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know how to get that uh to get that to happen again. That was that was that was weird. Yeah, this I think this is the best way. Perfect. Okay, so it's on... It's near the entrance of, the, so the, of, of this next room. That's where the fourth gear is. that it was near near the entrance hmm I doubt that I actually got it because now I don't oh wait no maybe okay maybe it means this one not, it's not on the outside. Uh, huh. Huh. Okay. <laughs> Let me just stand back here then. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. And 
now. Okay, that's okay. That was simple enough. Yeah, I just got the paint rooms confused with. Fifth gear can be found at the exit of the paint building near the ledge. There we go. And grab those. Oh, stay over here. And the sixth one can be found near the vort near the vortex that takes you out of the level. Go around the pillar to the left side and destroy it. Alright. Pretty... Pretty straightforward. There it is. That should have been all six. Or do you have to do it? Do you have to do it all in one life? Hmm. That's actually a good point. I wonder if you do. I wonder if I do have to do them all in one life. Well, that's okay. Uh, I, I didn't get the trophy, just FYI. But I I think. Oh wait, I didn't get all the treasure, did I? No, I did not. So, <laughs> I'm gonna have to go back in regardless. Yeah, I did not get the rest of the treasure. Like, uh... Like, a silly. I'm very... Yeah, I was just missing five. So, I'll head back in here, uh, do the entire level again, and uh, re-get all the, all the gears, and then uh, meet back outside. Okay, so, I did go back, so I just finished going back, and uh, I got not only the last uh, five gems, or the, f the, the one five gem that I needed, which is actually right, almost right by the beginning. And I read off, I read out all the, all the, all the gears. And yes, you do have to get all the gears, uh, in one. Uh, yeah, you do have to get all the gears, in one life, in order for it to, correctly, uh, work. So let's head on to Nasty Nork. Oh yeah, I I remember this a little a little too well. <laughs> Since I don't have sparks, but that's okay. I'll get him right back here. But yeah, I, I always I always hated this that he just he just stands up on his stands up there and just will constantly keep, try, keep trying to shoot you. And I know I have to do all this in one life, so I think I'll just go through and grab all the treasure. And then and then take it seriously from uh, from that point. get close to him, that's all I need. Nah. Ooh. 
What? Oh, come on. There we go. Okay, so, grab that. Okay, at least, at least this way I can get a feel for the route that I take. And where's, like, the best way to potentially get him. Oh, dude, okay, so it puts me, yeah, it puts me right there, so I just have to grab this guy, just quick. There we go. Alright. Now, deal with... I'll deal with him. Now there is a trophy where I have to make him go uh, five laps around this area, which I'm gonna have to anyways, just to, or I'm gonna have to go another lap just to kill the treasure again, because I'm, uh, I'm missing a bunch here. So I think, so I, yeah, so I think right now I won't, uh, yeah, I'll just, I'll just, I'll, I'll just kind of on purpose make him go, uh, a couple, make him go those laps. then dash the entire way and so let's see if it kind of works if it works on uh, on it at this point which I I imagine that it would So I think this is now four laps. And then Yeah. Yeah, so this is this is four. Let's see if it works. After I do, after I do this, so this one I'm this, so this lap I'm going to take. I think I'll take seriously. But yeah, I, I I know that I, I always hated this. I always hated doing this as a kid. There we go. Alright, so there's the trophy for doing five laps. And now... Here comes the annoying part. Well, that was actually incredibly easy. <laughs> You're toast, Nork! Awesome. All right. I expect it to be a lot harder than that. <laughs> Sorry I took so long. Almost forgot about you guys. What about Ganasty Ganork? Nasty Nork is toast. 
So, now there's order again in the Dragon Kingdom? Uh, well, mostly. I've still got some treasure to find. What will you do next? I'd say the sky's the limit. <laughs> Man, there's no shades yet. Where's the shades? Come on. <laughs> oh, who knows? Maybe, maybe that'll be... Maybe that'll be, uh... Maybe that'll come up again later. But, uh, who knows? Uh, so I wonder... Good, I can skip these. Because that is not it. I, I do have everything else, but that is not it. So I believe I have everything else completed. But yeah, the, the, the smaller the smaller moving platforms, I used to always hate trying to go through them. So if I'm correct, yep, everything else is right. Nasty's ancient history now. So what's in there? I believe this is Nasty's treasure hoard. But the gate will only open if you have found everything in the Dragon Kingdom. Come back when you have reached 100%. Well, it just so happens that I am 100%. Thank you very much. So this is where, again, that whole, you know... Oh, does the Dragon Kingdom have 12,000 or 14,000 treasure? This is where the other 2,000 treasure comes from. Alright, so, what... Oh yeah, I forgot, I, I legit forgot, you can just straight up fly during this whole thing. So, I need to go through and find all the treasure. Hmm. I feel... Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I feel. I, yeah, the, there is something over there, but I have to. I have to wait. So I have to open up the uh, other pathways, and that allows me to fly up higher. Yeah, so I'm gonna need to find keys along the way. Climb up there later. I love that there's only like tens and twenty fives along the way. Yeah, so now that opens up this. So now I can fly up from a higher area to reach over here. I'm ch I wonder. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay, then this, this I, I believe, then gives me ability to fly everywhere.
Uh, okay, maybe there's maybe there's one more. Okay, that. Okay, so that part's good. Much treasure is awesome. Alright, so then now. Now that, yeah, that's right. This is where I have to actually fly through this area. Um, yeah, he went the other way, but. I'm gonna see if I can catch up to him. I probably won't, won't be able to work this way. But that's why this is here. Yeah, there he is. You can't escape from... Oh, man. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I can feel it. I'm, like, literally right there. There we go. Unlocks that, which in turn gives me the ability to fly up here. And I think the rest of it is just it's just this way. <laughs> there we are. Last trophy hoarder and platinum for Nasty's demise. <laughs> I love the way that this looks too. <laughs> All right, so that I think is good. That's pretty much going to be it. Um, so yeah, that is a total of a 120% uh, playthrough in about five in about five hours. Um, but there 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 were a couple times where I I left the game uh, kind of just on here and there. But let's see the uh, actual ending. There's the shades. <laughs> the dragon. You've defeated Ganasty Ganor, collected the dragon eggs, saved all the dragons, and recovered every bit of treasure in the Dragon Kingdom. How do you feel? I feel fired up, Bob. And I'm happy for the dragon world, of course. I certainly wouldn't want to spend the rest of my dragon days butting heads with Nasty Nork and his weird minions. What's a minion? Uh, never mind. You know what they say, <laughs> for every good battle, you need a good adversary. And I felt that Nasty, in spite of his misguided nature, was a worthy opponent. Uh-oh, here we go again! It's weird that it, it, it kind of... It, I, I don't know, I always found it weird, like, it continues off of, like, you know, oh boy, here we go again, sort of thing that he's actually not gone or, or or something or somebody else turned the dragons to crystals. And then in the next game it's never brought up again. 
but obviously, but obviously for for some for something like this as a a new game uh, back to the day that uh, that they're that you know they want to keep their options open. So you're gonna tell me you put a door here and there you, you're ne you're not gonna show what's in it. That's such a tease. Anywho, um, yeah, so that that was a uh, full 120% playthrough and a platinum uh, run, a uh, platinum trophy uh, run of the uh, Spiral of the Dragon on the Reunited Trilogy. Uh, again, this game looks uh, and feels amazing. It it really does. Uh, I I I, th I may have said it once before on this, but I know I've said it uh, before many times that this is kind of in the way of how, as a kid, I looked at the game. Like the game looked this good, uh, but then to actually play it in the same sort of sense that of how I looked at it as a kid is like an entirely different feeling. So like I'm I'm so happy with with the way with the way just it looks and and feels and sounds um although again this is not this is this isn't even my my this is not even my favorite spyro game in fact i probably don't even have like i i really don't, don't even have like the most nostalgic feelings for uh as much nostalgic feelings for this game as much of the sequel which tends to happen a lot for me like I like I tend to I like the first game for mini series, uh, but nowhere near to the point of the second one. Again, Spyro. Uh, again, I'll, I'll go like Spyro Two, Ripto's Rage, uh, Sly Two, Band of Thieves, Kingdom Hearts Two. Like the exact same thing. Like they they just do everything the first one did, but better in almost every aspect. Uh, in my opinion. But that will be it for, for this, uh, so I want to thank everyone for watching, and uh, coming up, I believe is probably, coming up is going to be a 100% uh, playthrough of Ripto 2, or Spyro 2, uh, yeah, Spyro 2, Ripto, Ripto's Rage, which again, that's the one I have probably easily the most nostalgic feelings for, uh, so uh, look forward to that. So uh, hopefully I will see you all in the next one.